three. Which of those three numbers has the most twos in it? The top, middle, or bottom? Bottom. How many twos are there? Two. Two. Which number has more threes in it? The top, middle, or bottom? Middle. How many threes are there? One. Two. Two. Now, I'm going to multiply those together. I'm going to multiply it this way. First, look for a 10. We do not have both a 2 and a 5, so we do not have a 10. Then I'm going to put them together since we have four factors. I'm going to try and fit those together so that we end up with two numbers less than 10. We end up with two numbers less than 10, then we can use our basic multiplication tables to come up with the answer. So I'm either going to make it 9 times 4 or 6 times 6, one of those two. You know, if I go the other way, 3 times 3 is 9, times 2 is 18, times 2 is 36. That may be a little bit more complicated. But if I keep my numbers under 10, then I can use my basic tables to come up with the answer. 